Zero the Crypto Miner here. I'm going to show you how to trade, mine, and sell Dashcoin. Why Dashcoin, you ask? Why not Dashcoin, I say. Now, I don't work for Dash or Antminer. I'm just sharing the knowledge that I've found along the way. In this video, we're going to be talking about the D3 Dash Miner from Antminer. The D3 is a smaller unit designed by Antminer to be fully adjustable. I prefer to run these smaller units as opposed to their larger S9J Bitcoin miners. These D3 units are less expensive and with an update these units are completely adjustable. Fans, frequency, power. With an update you can adjust the units to fit your needs from low power to full power, meaning low mining to full mining. Now as you can see, in full mining mode these units can be quite loud. With the update, these fans and power consumption can be turned down to low, almost silent. The update I'm talking about is a no-fee ant miner firmware upgrade, available on eBay. Now you can turn the fans down to silent, adjust your power, even adjust your frequencies. One thing I like to do to reduce heat is put the power in front of the unit. Then I found these adapters on Amazon so I can pull the heat out through air ducting with an inline fan. Now once you start mining you're going to need a crypto wallet. Coinbase is easy to use but I don't suggest selling your Dash on Coinbase. I use Coinbase to convert my Dash to Bitcoin or Dogecoin depending on the rate. I don't sell my Dash coin on Coinbase because you lose money on the conversion. Coinbase is perfect for a beginner, but there are better wallets out there. It's very easy to use, but it's also easy to lose money with. Now there are a few really good apps to use. NiceHash, Coinbase, Slushpool, Webull, Robinhood, and Antpool are all good crypto trading tools. Now there are different ways to mine with this miner. With NiceHash, you can mine Bitcoin. With Antpool, you can mine Dashcoin. NiceHash will allow you to earn Bitcoin, track rigs and prices. You can also decide whether you want to mine Bitcoin or Dashcoin, depending on the exchange rate that day. Today there was more profit in the mining of Dashcoin. Just go over to NiceHash.com, create an account, and add the addresses to your miner. It's that simple. Now if you want to mine Dash directly, you can mine Dash directly from Antpool. Antpool has reasonable fees and it's easy to set up. I prefer Antpool to Slushpool because their fees are lower. With the D3 and the update, it's less expensive to run more than one unit when you can run them all low or you can run them as high as you want, all depending on your budget. You can find D3 units on Amazon, eBay, even Mercury. At first I would just buy a used unit with a used power source just to get started. Once you get used to things, buy another unit, add to the chain. Pretty soon you'll have a farm. Cryptocurrency is the way of the future. And with the D3 Dash Miner, it's simple and less expensive than running a full-sized Bitcoin miner. This is Zero the Crypto Miner, saying goodbye for now. Happy crypto mining.